ready. Live stream starting. How is your day, you guys? Well, this time it's quite rare on the day that I have a day off. And, yep, the live stream day at the same time. So that's good. I did it early. <laughs> Green trail, get some food, snacks, drinks, stuff, prepare them around, get more friends to join in the chat, talking, lurking, stuff with you guys, and stay determined. Okay. <laughs> Exclamation from Lonely. Welcome to the live stream. How is your day? That's the first time you... No, not quite. Not quite the first time, but... It's been a while that you... <laughs> Iconic? Is that talking? <laughs> what is this? I can create it November 20, 2020. <laughs> Is that intended? Wow. Well, the time is ticking down real quick here today, no?
Hmm. Is this? Are we going to Hogwood? <laughs> anyway, you guys, here's the intro. Hey to you guys, my name's Nico, and welcome to the Little Witch in the Woods. This game brought to you by Keep the Barbarian. Thank you for the sponsor. Anyway. So, this is like the game I... Well, I put it in a wish list, but... Someone brought it, brought it to me. Brought it to me for me. Thank you, again. And the button controlling is kind of like... Old, to whole game stuff. I'm not complaining, but... It's been a while, controlling this way. And that train reminds me of the, the hot swap also. <laughs> I wonder where the carrot was. Ellie, okay. You're still thinking about that? Oh, we have a talking cat? You're still taking talking thing about that? We found everything except the carrot. I think it's good that we never found the carrot. There was something off about that legendary carrot soup recipe. I just realized we never checked the me men's restroom. Oh no, are we gonna find carrots in there? Yes, th there are just some lines you don't cross. We searched the whole school safe for that place, but we never found the carrot. That means the carrot was in the men's restroom. What got into your thought that it could be in there? A carrot in the men's restroom? What an odd sense of humor. Aish. Or she just had some dirty thoughts. <laughs> I should write Jenny a letter asking her to look through the men's restroom. Can't you ask Will instead? It's the men's restroom, after all. Nope, that coward finds it. He will take it to the teacher, bowling like before. Keep in mind that if it weren't for Will, you would be in jail right now. Or six feet under. Ugh, I'm so bored. It's a flashback. Flashbacks are supposed to be boring. I see why no one else wants to ride this god-awful train. It's boring. Enough to drive anyone insane. What was that sound outside? Hey, a ticket for this train costs 500 pies. And it stops. The witch's house in High Lion. Where all roads lead to. You are second place. At a school of witch for witches. Whatever, I don't care about any of that. How am I the second place anyway? I even sneak into the forbidden room twice. <laughs> Three times. Even I even looked through the forbidden books in the for in the hidden library in the school basement. I still remember that. One rabbit that was as big as a horse. No wonder will state start crying. <laughs> so how did I manage second place? I simply didn't want to lose. Cut it out and sit quietly. This is a dream only for those who want to succeed. The witch's house might be dark and dim, but it's only three years off for of your life. Fine, fine, enough with the lecture. As a matter of fact, I'm disturbed with the thought of taking off my shoes when I get off the train. Shoes? For what? 
I wonder what kind of trouble you'll get into when we arrive. I won't. I won't fool around the moment I got there. Get there. I didn't know you had self-awareness. Don't you know about the terrible city of rules that in Highline? Hylian? Hylian? I don't know. The first thing to do is to take your shoes off as soon as you get off the train. This is the first time hearing something like that. I heard that Jenny's older sister was wearing strappy boots when she first arrived in Highland. So she almost couldn't get off because she had to unstrap them un completely. See? Mom brought me new shoes as well. Didn't Era just mean to encourage you? Now Dad also says that comfortable boots would be better. That's strange. It's true. I'll also ask other people if you don't believe me. Oi. <laughs> Keywords gain. Lace up boots. It's a pain to wear lace up boots if you are boarding the train in Highland. Oh, now I move around. The food was really delicious though. Your face was bright only when you were eating after it got in to the train on the train. The omelette was overflowing with cheese and crab meat as soon as it was cut. The pea salmon steak seasoned with fresh lemon scents kiwi sauce. Even the slightly frozen strawberry and peach sorbet with whipped cream. Without this meal, I would have jumped off the train sooner. <laughs> it's definitely different from the food you buy at the store at the school for witches. I ate that to collect the Great Witch series cards. I got scalped because I was caught keeping the cards and throwing away the bread. Don't do that again in High Lion. I will definitely try the Nubicula cupcake there. That's if I get to High Lion before I get bored to that. Alright, so let's move around. Bartender. Hello, Mr. Bartender. Hey, you want a drink? No, I don't drink alcohol. Do you have any tea? Of course. Then I will have a cup of that. The tea has alcohol. Though, is that okay? <laughs> What? <laughs> but then that's just alcohol. Alcohol with tea. Potato, potato. Then can I ask you a question instead of a drink? Anytime. Want some water? <laughs> Personal story, chit chat, shop. Hmm. Let me know if you need anything to drink. What's up? What sort of work do you do here? I'm mixing my life and changing the alcohol. Wait, I think it's the other way around. I'm just an average bartender working the most expensive place in the world. What brings you into this very expensive train? I thought you were listening to our conversation. I stopped listening when I got boring. <laughs> I'm going to be an apprentice at the witch's house in Highline. After working as an apprentice for three years, I'll be able to graduate from the school of witches. For witches. Wow, Highline, huh? That's the right proper place, isn't it? So they say. That's probably why you got the train ticket for free. It must be someone special. I don't really care about that kind of thing, though. That kind of thing is what important at the end of the day. It's best to just suck it up. <laughs> You'll be glad you did later down the road, you know? Yeah, 
later. Something on your mind? We will sell alcohol at the moment. Want some water? Nah. Wait, what? Training activities? No. Special. Can I take a look of your sh at your shoes? What kind of question is that? <laughs> My shoes? What for? From what I have heard, you have t to take your shoes off before you step foot into the Highland Station. You were at the train, so you know what I'm talking about, right? Oh, that story. Absolutely. Plenty of confused passengers who were all dressed up for Highland. If you are wearing shoes of that sort, I would advise you to untie them in advance. Oh uh, yeah. Or oh, you yeah, who rush at Highland. Look first upon tight shoes. Or so, that's how the saying goes. See, Virgil, I was right. The preppy boots mom gave me as a present tell me just as much. Those are some nice boots, right? My mom bought them for me when she found out I was graduating. <laughs> what? Manakam land. It sure is amazing you are graduating in Manakam land despite your antics. You gonna keep up with that attitude of yours? <laughs> Hearing the two of you speak. I have the feeling being boredom won't be an issue. Nope, it's so boring. Are you bored, Mr. Partender? I have gotten used to it. But it's certainly gotten less boring, thanks to you and your hat. You've been listening? Other guests would have heard about your action arson at the school for witches by now. I didn't set it on fire. Really? Uh, sure, there was a fire, but that was because I sh shook a potion five times and made it explode. Potion must be shaken three times only. Even a non-witch like me knows that. Wow. Is that so? Exactly! How can you not try shaking f four times having heard that? But you said you shook it five times. Nothing happened on the fourth time, so I shook it once more. <laughs> An inquisitive mind, you have already got the making of the fine witch. Thanks for the praise. I don't think he was praising you. <laughs> I should be on my way then. Alright then, have a fun trip. You can't act like the country pumpkin once you are at once you are in the city, got it? You are not getting to ask just one person, are you? Why? What is never enough, you know? Even the greatest detectives never reach a conclusion based on single piece of evidence. Hmm, you have a point. You can view your notes to see the keywords you have. Hmm. It's a pain to wear lace up boots if you're avoiding the train to the High Lion. So there's another two guy. So that's another one. I really like the animations here. The pixel art. I really dig it. It's a familiar face. It was always her name, 
that come up first when memorizing names of witches who had great achievements. You mean that weird song? I made it as part of the exam strategy. I sang it in my in my head when I was taking the history exam, and I'm seeing her again in the train. I should I still like it this witch. Oh, witch, help those in your reach. It's famous saying. All right, ordinary passenger. Hello. Oh, hello. Am I disturbing you? Negative. What's the issue? Oh, I was. I want to ask you about something. You're on the way to Highland, right? Correct. Hmm. What's the matter? Oh, it's just that you have a very blunt way of speaking. Oh my. Old habit dies hard, especially when one is deep in thought. It sounds like you're a janitor from my school. <laughs> well, he used to be a soldier. So what brings you here? Speak. Oh. <laughs> Alright, personal uh, let's do chat for now. Since I'm not much of a talker, I don't have anything to say on the time. Speak. That's the way the soldier talks. I mean, some soldiers. <laughs> you live in Highland? Correct. I own a fellow shop there. Ooh. Wow. Speak. <laughs> Calm down, dude. Shop. I did run a flower shop, but as you can see, I'm just a normal passenger at the moment. Speak. Before that. What? You have been star staring at my feet for a while. You got some kind of problem. Oh, I was going to ask anyway. Isn't it uncomfortable to wear such as strappy boots? It takes some time to put them on. And take them off, but I'm used to it. Then it would be hard for you when you arrive at High Lion. What? What are you talking about? I mean, you have to take your shoes off when you got when you get off. What? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> huh? Oh, you were kidding. I'm sorry. I'm rather dull when it comes to the things like this. Jenny! Mr. Bartender! The mystery has been solved. <laughs> Didn't make some kind of mistakes. No, no, I just realized that I was the thief. Kind of think of it. I remember now. It's a joke to make fun of people who visit Holland for the first time. Stop, you don't have to kill me twice by giving them such a deal. I'm sorry. Are you holding back laughter? No, I'm not. He's trying so hard to be considerate of you. Don't ask twice. Virgil, I hate you even more now. You don't need to be too upset. When I went there for the first time in the past, I was also tricked by the colleague and took them off. That doesn't comfort me at all. I'm sorry. How do you feel? Why are you asking me that? Your molars might fall out. Relax a bit and tell me. I can't believe Jenny defeated me. There's a reason why she's your friend. Now go back to your seat quietly and wait until we arrive. We still have to, tr to three more days to go. Three more days. That's as adorable as the smell of the spot shtage mushrooms. So I was wondering if I still had to talk to the dog. But I want to talk to the dog. Oh, never mind. It's not a dog. More like the a. Other? Train crew. Up ahead is the train engine room. 
Lots of our forbidden during operation. Up ahead is an ancient room. <laughs> I'm an attendant of the Bright Man Railroad. Road. My job is to ensure the passenger from Ford in safety. And I'm ahead of the truth. <laughs> sure, yeah, I know. <laughs> Please save any inquiries regarding safety at the station until we. Until after we exit the train. I'm ahead in the danger. <laughs> sure! <laughs> okay. Alright. Now I was wondering what if I'm not talking to the dog and talk to the, the weasel guy? The we oh wait, weasel? Or otter? Before. I'm not sure if she will just gonna be like satisfying and go back to that and still re removing the shoes at the end. <laughs> anyway. Alright, now have some patience and stay seat. Ugh. I'm bored. Oh, you just sat down. This is torture. Stare out the window if you're bored. Yeah, look outside. Look at that mountain. It must be hiding a cave with strange pillars, stretch, statues, and giant door. Sounds like a prologue to the story when you awake a turbo demon. Wait, hold on, Virgil. Shut up and look at the window. At the, sub at the summit of the mountain, there's a jacket and shining tree at the top. A jack and shining trees. Why is it shining? Does it have the luminous flowers? It must be beautiful up close. Give it up. This train won't stop for two days. <laughs> uh, I want to get out now. Oh, we crashed. Whoa. A fat chance of that happening, so just stay bored. After all, you signed up for three years of even more boredom. Aren't these. Aren't there any crocopans nearby? Nope. <laughs> what about boar constrictors? This is in the jungle. Train robbers? This is in the Wild West. It's a healing game, remember? Healing game? Oh. Hey, a boar, a boar constrictor. The correct line is what's going on. <laughs> there's no station here. Why we stop? I'm not sure. Maybe there's something wrong with the train. I thought it's a board constrictor, though. No. I don't care if it's not a board constrictor. Please just say there's something massive, critical issues. Please, please, please. <laughs> Boy, she is one of the troublemakers, is she? We apologize for the inconvenience. A critical issue, perhaps? The train cannot continue its journey due to the critical issue. Yes. <laughs> Attention, the train will stop until tomorrow morning. And departure times. Can we go outside? Will likely be announced tomorrow. We will de depart immediately if possible. Okay, we'll be back. <laughs> I'll be back in a bit. In the meantime, please avoid wandering too far from the train. Let's go. I'm not sure if you remember, but... Of course I remember. The shining tree is at the peak. No, not that. We have to get back by tomorrow morning. Then we should get going. Oh boy. <laughs> Alright, do we talk to people? Welcome. Welcome. What's the water? Goodbye. Whoa, it's dark. If you're scared, we can go back to the train. Love it. Let's hurry.
Sorry, you can't go beyond here. Why did the train stop? There's something in the train path. We're working on getting rid of whatever it is in the way. Something in our way? Is it a boar constrictor? A boar constrictor? No, no. It's a strange pricky vine. A strange pricky vine? It's a pricky vine. It wasn't there yesterday, but it seems to have grown overnight. We can't seem to cut it down with a regular axe, but we'll do the, tr the best or rest. We have contact the witches, so I'm sure they will be here to help in no time. Can I take a look? I happen to be a witch. You are our passenger. It's our responsibility to make sure you're safe. I'm not sure why there's a black ant growing around my table now. Where are the keys though? We'll take, we'll take care of it, so please be patient. Can I take, take a peek? I'm sorry. Oh, whoops. Did it skip? God damn it. Anyway. <laughs> she doesn't even want to go back into the train. Save. Do it. <laughs> Is this? It's a hill. It won't be easy to climb. Look over there. There's a vine hanging on a tree on a hill. I'll be able to climb that much. That's bad news. <laughs> it's a secret passageway, Virgil. Don't, I don't think it's a secret or a passageway. I bet there's a path to be on there here. <laughs> and somebody turns into a horror game. <laughs> What's this? Looks like a little horny pumpkin. What's that? It's a type of weed that grows in the forest areas. The vines grow so fast that you can never get rid of by hand. You might find a nucleus hidden somewhere to get rid of it. Then I guess I can also get rid of this if you find a nucleus. Or just return to the train quietly. That can't happen. Let's go look for the nucleus. It must be nearby. Send the nucleus give off light when you touch the vines. You will be able to find it. You can temporarily get rid of the vine with the weed terminator potion. <laughs> what? But they will grow back after a while. Then what do we do? Find a core. It should be somewhere near the vines. Time to explore! Please don't use that word, explore. That word gave me anxiety. No thanks to your mother. Sprint! Crying apple. Wow, sounds lovely. Which flower? Which flower? The shining tree is at the peak of the mountain, so... So go quick if you want to see it. We must return to the train by the morning tomorrow. Yeah, yeah. How do I... Get this thing. Great. 
Green forest depth. It's a freaking K! Shining tree is at a peak. I know! Stop telling me what to do. <laughs> this thing again. Yes, 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 yes. The time's not ticking down, so stop whining, Virgil. Look, very, very shiny drinks. Huh? Dude, stop telling me what to do. I'm exploring. Oof. There's a town. There's a town. Virgil. But you have to go to High Lion. What a shame. I didn't miss that. Dude, stop. Virgil. <laughs> it didn't have the right shock. Oh, I'm shocked. It's too dark and worn down for me to see anything. See any words, only pictures. Let's come back when it's brighter.
the village I saw the sign must be this way. But it's blocked by the little horny honey pumpkin. Well, I guess I will use the potion at some point. Alright, not sure if it's still around things to gather, but let's go to the trees. A mountain! <laughs> That's a bad thing, right? I always hated mountains. My letter. Get warns out from the wind. Mango. Maple herb. I wanna get to get all kind of stuff around here. What even is this? Piece of rock. Why are there so many things blocking the path? This must be the forest with the many secrets. What's this? Looks like the barrier made of the witch pattern. Witch patterns? Is there a witch here? There was or Do you know how it works? Still hammered it into my head. Shouldn't be an issue. Long as it's drawn well. Sure.
ち<笑>怖っ。Zombie pads. Whoa. Okay. Big tree. Wow. It's a giant, gigantic giant tree. The same one as we saw from the train. This is a busy great tree trace. I don't think the tree, this is the one that's shiny. Check this out, Virgil. There's a ton of butterflies on it. You're right. The butterflies seem to be glowing. Those are blue moon butterflies. The butterfly gives off the subtle light moon, moonlight. The light from these butterflies has the same power as actual moonlight. Really? <laughs> That's why strange things always happen around these butterflies. Aren't they beautiful? A giant tree trees? With the butterfly glowing with the moonlight. It's not just beautiful, it's an extremely fascinating sight to behold. Isn't it a pretty magnificent discovery? Do you know that these, those two are rare creatures? So, what about it? The fact that those two are together is amazing. What about those two being together? They're usually raised together. Artificially to get moon flower to Lucerine or to what? <laughs> it's uncommon from for them to be together naturally like this. Um anyway, we did find something, right? I guess so. I'll have to write a letter to the school later later. Let's look around a bit more. Fill up with the codex and all, right? Just don't be late. You must return to this train by tomorrow morning. Okay. Let's go back to the way we came. There's might be other strange things. In search for the curious creatures. We trace your path. Of course. <laughs> no keywords. I don't think I'll be. I'll get a wink of sleep on the train. I wonder if there's anywhere I can sleep for the night. What about the ground? The dirt and rock should make a nice bed. That's not funny, Giorgio. <laughs> Little blue mud, blue moon butterflies beside the peak is here too. You might as well collect some for study purposes. Oh, now we can collect them. You think I could just sneak up and grab it? Wait, do you remember what Mr. Gravier said? That lives under the bed? No, not that. Dry before you touch it. That's right. Which encyclopedia and quill? Press and hold to use a quill to draw. Approach it and use a quill to draw in in the encyclopedia. I did it. Click that. Swap tools. Oh, I see. Moment, blue moon butterflies. A butterfly that emits a lot of blue light from absorbing moonlight. It is sensitive to sounds, but will not easily go away unless it feels intentionally threatened. Habitat and the time occurrence. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Great. It's registered in the catalog. Let's see. Where do you get that glasses? Now, do you see why you can't catch any, any right now? Well, we cannot catch them because we don't have the tools. 
Hmm, so you can collect them using the butterfly net. I don't have one right now. Not much you can do right now, though. But I want to do it right now. Getting to the witch's house in Highland is more important. <laughs> Let's go back down now. There's gonna be something else than this one. Flower. Which flower? <laughs> I completely missed that. But why can't pick it up? Come on. Hmm? Red herb that roots itself the cliff also called coward grass because children think of the herb as a show of bravery. I like that they grow on the soil, its roots are to spread in the wild. So try to pull it while sneaking it at the angle instead of pulling it straight up. Is that so? You didn't know that. I think there's a man mango, although I missed. Change itself. Oh wow, it's a cat. <laughs> Ellie, let's go back to the train. Look at that Virgil, a shiny white cat. I have never seen anything like that before. Ellie, we have to. Let's go after that creature. Okay, <laughs> cheer as she goes. So I can do like the shaky shaky again to let the... Let's forget on what we're doing now. Do. What did he get wrong? Silver Star Bell. Oh, that thing. I went and walked onto it. The pollen that bursts from the buds as its flower can be collected. So they have to use a. Okay. No, the shiny cat. Which white shock? I think the cat dropped something and left. What's this? Looks like a witch shock. That thing you use to draw things like a patterns. It looks like a different from the one we used to using at school. It's just a different packaging, <laughs> I think. All right, let's hold on. Oh, really? This which pattern seems to have been erased a bit. It won't work if it gets erased like this. You can draw the patterns again using the same colored witch to shock. So we have one I just picked up earlier. Let's draw it again with that. Should I draw the witch pattern again using one witch white shock? 
All right, activate the witch patterns again. Hold on. It's a little overkill. Did a cat go? Look, Virgil, there's a house. That's a witch's house, isn't it? It looks pretty old. I guess we can talk to the master witch here and stay here for a while. It doesn't look like there's a people inside. If there's no one, I must stay for a while. Isn't it natural for an apprentice witch to be at the witch house? That's true, but. Can I throw a pumpkin? Take a nap right now. Anyone there? Is anyone anybody there? See like nobody here. It could be an abandoned witch house. Because the witch administrations can't figure out everything. Everything. Alright, let's go inside. Naughty girl. Oh. It really is an abandoned witch's house. Taking that into consideration, it looks okay. Although it's not that clean. Since the witch's house is managed on her own. It doesn't seem to be in a very good condition, considering how dirty it is. But the bed looks fine. <laughs> I guess I can just sleep here. Um, well, since the witch house is a public institution, it's okay to sleep one night or so. And it's better than sleeping outside. Stamina, I say. This is stamina system. Clean up. The house is a bit messy. We'll just sleep for one day. Who cares? So we sleep now? <clears throat> oh. Hmm. What's with that face? You slept on a nice fluffy bed. Yes, bud. I dreamed that I was sleeping on that train. All that effort not to sleep on the train, only to dream of just that. You should have just slept on the train. No, that's not it. I slept very well, actually. I can almost hear the sounds of the train, though. Wait, isn't that actually the sounds of the train? Wait, what, really? Isn't it taking off already? Let's hurry. Oh, shit, let's run! <laughs> Safe. It is really sounds of the train. I think it's about to take off. Let's hurry back. I woke up just in time. Glad I didn't sleep in. Squishy shop. Barrow and live. Barrow and live under the ground. Group two, two. Okay. And now they're next to me.
Oh, those holes. It's a jar. Calm down, a train. later. Imagine it cannot run like dynamically. Huh. Where's the train? <laughs> it went off. It's a freaking bird <laughs> making sounds. <laughs> Looks like that bird was imitating train sounds. But where's the train? It probably went to the highland. And what do we do now? Let's look around the area. I'm sure we'll find some clues. Why are you so calm? I've been through much worse with you, mom. <laughs> Fucking hug the freaking bug. What's that thing? It's called the Gaga Bird. They say it's a bit insane. Quiet, I don't want to hear it. <laughs> it's your fault for Earth sleeping. Don't blame the Skaga Burb. <laughs> Fine, whatever, just be quiet. Hello. <laughs> hey, Kiba, welcome to live stream. What you missed? Well, we got into the. We are in the train. The train got stuck. I walk outside. She got ex exploring stuff. And come back with the with the late pay. If the train went off, it's the bird making the sound of the train. <laughs> yeah, like it does like a very beginning. It's a book here, a letter. How nice of them to leave a letter behind. Let's see. I think it's from the bartender on the train. You're probably shocked to see that the train is gone. A witch suddenly appeared in the middle of the night and got rid of the pretty vines. They said they can't wait because the train was already see light, so we had to leave. But don't worry, the train will come back and there's a village nearby where I used to live. You can just spend some time there. There should be a sign to the forest, so take a look and go find the village. When you arrive at the village, please send a knight and Arden to my regards, bartender. That place we saw earlier must be a village. Are you even a little upset that we missed the train early? It's okay, since there's a village, right? I guess we can just wait there. How about cleaning the witch's house? We must get rid of the pretty vines at the village entrance. Okay. Please try not to sound so excited. We missed the train, remember? Right. You heard me right. Well, then I might as well add more to the encyclopedia now. The fucking train. The control is kind of like old school. Old school controlling of the games. Or like. What's that? Old school RPG games, stuff like that? Oh, now the time's ticking. 840. Let's get it on the weed first. If too much, it would take forever to pull all this out by using hands. Take a look at the bin over there. It might have a, pota a potion to get rid of weeds. 
Is there? Take a nap. There's nothing here. Then we'll have to use another tool. Is there another tool? Yes. There's a wonderful tool. What's that? Your hands. Ah! <laughs> I see. Start pulling. <laughs> the grass is like pulling up itself. How's the gameplay? Hmm. Gonna say it's kind of towards more the relaxing games to play. Alright, I think I got rid of all of them, right? It's nice to see that it's clean. Now, it's time to tidy up the house. Alright. I like the... the pixel art of the game. Pretty nice. The galley. It's a quest mark. What? All I see is dust and cobwebs and all we have to clean up. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Let's find something useful while cleaning. Is there anything else I can find? I forgot what we're doing now. I'm clicking! Oh, it's a notebook. Might be useful later. What oh, those fast? It's a witch bookshelf. Technically, it's a bookshelf that the witch was using. That seems as a witch bookshelf. I'm not going to read the book, though I'm tired of books. A poisonous mushroom is better than a witch who doesn't read books. <laughs> what does it mean? Because a poisonous mushroom kills just one person. Stop nagging, I read enough books at school. Witch history, page 12, plants, fun books of plants, gardening for witches. There are so many books out of plants. I guess a witch who used to research plants was living here. I should store, uh, store any books I get in here. She really messed up the house. <laughs> It reminds me of your room. My room was cleaner than this. That might be some... Might be so from a dust standpoint. Oh. Inventory, I say. I wonder where the witch is. The one who lives here. This place is probably very old. She must be eating and living well somewhere in the Lucerne or two. All done cleaning. It's also messy in front of the desk over there, Ellie. Stop buzzing around like a teacher. I finally managed to get out of the school. <laughs> There's some dust over there, Ellie. Don't leave food behind, Ellie. I told you not to go inside the principal's office, Ellie. <laughs> you should have listened. 
Oh, this is the witch elevator. That's why you have to listen to the teachers. Let's hurry up and go down. What if there's a scary monster? You think so? Oh, I'm so excited. God damn it. <laughs> this girl. Gonna say, I kind of... Hmm. Might play this one in the, like, in really, really relaxing times and stuff like that. <laughs> but I prefer more actions. <laughs> anyway. Oof. That's a lot more things to claim, no? Wow, look at this, Rachel. This must be the dispensary. You can probably take potions with a proper tool. We should definitely do some cleaning. Wow, cleaning again. <laughs> sure. Aquad. Wish flower extract. I clean here. Squishy chub fur extract. What the hell is that? I know what it says. It's an extractor. We used so many times at school. It was slightly smaller than one though. It would be a hard to use. Look at the glass bottle underneath. <clears throat> oh, that's true. Is it broken? I'll need a friendly toad at least. <laughs> I'll need to get a glass bottle first in order to use this. You need to at least fix the extractor in order to make potions. Alright, let's go to the village first. Let's look for one. I mean, we haven't cleaned all the things here yet. A box is pretty useful. I can put stuff in here when I my pocket are full. So apparently, there's a different box for stuff. Maple herbs extract. A roaster? Ugh, I hate this thing. You have to put in the ingredients and just wait. Is also. I can simply just put them in and do something else while you are waiting. It seems to be in bad condition, however. Really? Oh yes. They so there's no handle for winding, winding the spring. Why would I get a roast roaster again? Handle. I don't need to the roaster since it is not need for the basic recipes. And there should be something when you get to the village. Yeah, the village comes first. By the way, there's nothing normal here. It would be rather strange to be in normal when it's dirty like this. <laughs> Whoa, we even put we the water? Wow, this is a pretty good kind of cauldron. I think it was made by the Blue Lightning Workshop. His style is very traditional. I've only ever used the cheap cauldron at a school. Finally, I could have used a good one. Do you remember how to use one? Of course. It's expertly process, process ingredients, the extract heat intensity and the right what? Ladling techniques. And the, at last. At last, you'll end up with a proper potion. Proper potion? I actually like teacher Olivia. Still, the cauldron looks fine. You'll be able to make potion if you have uh, the ingredients. The machines still are in bad condition though. Since there are some discard ingredients, let's make the potion we need to use them for now. Oh?
This is a potion ingredients, isn't it? You have used them in a school countless of times. Are we just usually this sloppy? Sloppy or not, they are careful with their ingredients. Then I guess the witch that lived here was really sloppy. Or she was in a hurry. <laughs> Why? Beat me. The spill bothers scribble paper and a book. What a mess. Just brush off the dust. <laughs> Just brush off the dust. Make things. Might take that lifetime. What's this? Lunar's oil. Looks like a recipe for our potions. I guess it was used by the witch who was here. It reads the potion with the po powered moon. The units are moon flowers and Phoenix Fanner. Only very expensive materials are used. <laughs> I'll get it someday. Let's have it already for now. There's also something underneath. Where? Oh, you're right. Hmm, I don't know what kind of thing is this. You learned it at school. It's ancient witch language. You mean I learned how to read these strange symbols? Your score wasn't bad either. Don't, I don't remember anything. Shall we take a look anyway? Mm, looks like a recipe. It seems like moon something. I have no idea. I got a headache. <laughs> take a look if you remember later. Unreadable memo. Yeah, I should put it away and revisit it later. But that would be nice to use in the watch bench later. Just no use for it right now. Uh, yes, I'm all done cleaning. We can make potions now. It would be hard to make properly because the machine's tools are broken. Since there were ingredients on the ground, let's try making with them for now. There was a little honey pumpkin in front of the village. The stubborn weed element elimination potion should do it, right? It's a weed terminator potion. <laughs> Whatever. Check the recipe in the encyclopedia. You'll probably be able to make it with the ingredients you were lucky enough to have on. <laughs> Alright, let's do it. Sure. Just tell me everything. One of this, one of that. Easy mode, stage four. Don't start. <laughs> Put two of the ex Oh wait. I mean, it's already extracted, right? So we need like two of the fur to make like one of the ex extract. And two of the witch flower to make another extract. Set the fire to stage four. Don't stir the ladle, don't stir. I mean. <laughs> Pour in the right vessels. Do we have the potion? Bottle? This recipe is shown at left. Yeah, yeah. We got an ingredient already. Use a few ingredients the information about it. Blah, blah, blah. Tap. After processing the collectible, put the ingredients into the witch pot and adjust the fire and ladles as needed to craft. I wonder why I just started using mouse control here. I just used this freaking. Well, buttons here. Try crafting with 
Terminator potion using the witch thing and that. Oi. The fire test for for ready, right? Yep, there we go. To make the best potion of this potion, of this, so to know what unwanted plant you are targeting, it is the most effective on the guard weeds. Awesome. The stubborn weed extermination potion is complete. It's a potion of removing weeds. Anyway, it's ready. Let's go throw it at the little honey plant pumpkin. You must use it carefully since there's no more ingredients. Okay, don't worry. You must throw it at the little honey pumpkin and make sure to remove the nucleus as well. Because weed exterminate, a uh, weed terminator potion is just a temporary measure. Got it. <laughs> right. Oh, <laughs> for saving? What should I do? Naps. Sure. Once per day. <laughs> Those rabbits are like question marks. Confused. Probably. Let's pass by quickly and find the nucleus in the meantime. Boop. Huh. This isn't a village. Look over there. Ellie. It's a pretty vine. This time. It's so huge and thick. Oh no. <laughs> what do you do with the extractor? First, take a look around here. Wisteria. The village is just ahead. Do you live in the town? Nature is so beautiful. What? <laughs> Aren't the trees beautiful? The green leaves are so pretty. Oh, sure. Nature is so breathtaking. You must love nature. How can you not? Okay, I'll be back. Wake under the blue sky and experience nature. She must be really damn dangerous. So much that she can't have a conversation. You should respect her interest. I think it's more of an obsession. <laughs> Something that it feels right. 
you think she's cursed or something? A curse can, that doesn't allow to, her to talk about anything except nature. The curse of nature, lover. That doesn't sound make sense, right? <laughs> There's a lot of quirky witch out here, which is out here. The curse lifting candy. That can lift the curse should be the basic recipe. Oh, but we can't use the machine tools now. I must process what I have been collected to make potion. What should I do? You picked up several ingredients on the workplace earlier, didn't you? Those would be enough to make curse living candy. And you can see what's next to her over there. Next to her what? It's a glass bottle. That would be perfect. As in glass extractor poach bottle. Where? Wow, you weren't kidding. Alright, now let's make curse lifting candy <laughs> to lift the curse. And to receive the glass bottle as a reward. <laughs> that would be nice. First, let's check on the candy that can lift the curse in the book. Alright, let's take the... Did I take the bottle already? Lunar oil. Curse living candy. Squishy shop for extractor and maple herbs. We already got them. Get the huge pretty vines. <sighs> wow, they're really big. Too big for the wheat. Terminator explosion, I think. Hmm. We'll have to do something else. We'll do the stay at the witch's house for a while. <sighs> okay, so maybe we'll make like a uh, a barrel of the potion to roll into it, maybe? There we go. Duster, fire set three. That should do. Mm-hmm. Eating the candy left weak curse. Horses and a tasty occasionally enjoy this as a snack. Apparently, there's just only one slot of saving. What the? <laughs>
Pumpkin Terrier. It leaves off the pumpkins type plant. It's left to play, so it will try to play hide and seek if you attempt to collect from them. Try to remove all the vines wrapping around it if you're curious what is the true apparent is. Oh, do, do I just take it from that like that? <laughs> just like pulling off from the, the rabbit. <laughs> Should I give her the curse lifting candy? This game is super adorable. Yeah, that's one thing I can give also. Very adorable. <laughs> Kinda cringe though. <laughs> Would you like to try this? May the blessing of nature away be with you. Hello? <laughs> yes, hello? Am I speaking properly now? Yes, I think so. Wow, thank you so much. The hell is nature? <laughs> I guess it really was a curse. I could tell that the old man I met in the western jungle was suspicious just by looking at him. Yet I simply couldn't ignore such a well-made wooden image of a monkey. As I bought it, I could only talk about crazy nature. I tried to speak backward, right? But I could only praise nature, pure torture. <laughs> I hope nature just rot and dies. Wow. <laughs> so I'm glad that the curse was easily removed. Oh, thank you so much. My name is Aurea. How long has it been since I said my name? <laughs> my name is Ellie. I'm a apprentice, which. Oh, did you come to this town to be an apprentice? I was on a train, but I got off for a moment, and it's left without me. Oh dear. I was about to enter the town, but it's blocked off by some pretty vines. Damn nature. <laughs> Damn nature. <laughs> Thankfully, we found an empty witch house nearby, so I have been staying there. An empty... Oh yes, there's a witch house there. That's good. I have been... I have business in the village too, but the vine stopped me. Nature be damned. She must really hate that now. <laughs> I'll be here for a while, so let me know if you need anything. Oh then, can I ask you for a favor? Not a favor, but a fair price. Wow. What do you need? The tools were broken when I was trying to use the dispensary at the witch house. 
Do you have any tools or parts? What kind of tools or parts do you need? I need a glass bottle for the extractor and a roaster handle for winding the roaster. Wait a minute, I'll look for them. Sure. But Ellie, don't you have any money? I do. Mom gave me a pocket money when I came out. You'd think you'll be able to buy witch tools with just enough pocket money to buy a snack or two. Uh, is that so? What if I don't have enough money? So you'd have tools make and sell potions or something. You can also sell candies now. Only if there's are if there are all people to buy them. Found him. Take this. Okay. How much is this? Oh, never mind. This is a return for breaking my curse. Wow, thank God. <laughs> Unfortunately, I don't have any roaster handle for the roaster. I see. Will you be staying at the village? If so, I'll bring it next time. It's <laughs> free. I'll sell it at the proper price then, however. Good. Please bring that then. Okay. I'll write roaster handle in the memo. Oh, and take this too. <laughs> oh yes, free stuff. A recipe for the candy if that quickly heals light wounds. Since the price of for the bottle earlier wasn't enough, I'll give this to you as well. Thank you. Sure come back next time? Now we'll be able to fix the extractor. But are you really going to stay in this village? I should until that dream comes. Really? I have no choice. No, I mean, are you really going to leave when the dream comes? That's... I'll decide when that happens. Let's just fix the extractor first. <laughs> Lot of tool stuff. Did they learn that I have pulled them? Imagine like it's kind of like a another type of Stardew Valley, something like that. That's what I'm thinking. Should I use a glass bottle I have for the extractor? Good. I can use an extractor. We can follow and make potions properly. Then what do we do now? Didn't you want to go to the village? You should remove the jacket and quickly die. That's true, but it seems impossible to get rid of that huge thing with the recipe I have now. The basic recipe does seem kind of inadequate. What's your plan? Now that the extractor has been fixed, you'll be able to make potion from the basic recipes. If you make wheat terminator potion, you can get rid of the little honey pumpkins. I'll be able to go to the place that I have been blocked. A little more, yeah. So, the forest. Let's look though, the forest. There must be something. That's what I'm saying. Well done. Farming it did.
Fine. How do you use the recipe though? I'll get to work on something here later. It's pretty useless now though. Do we do upstairs? Sleepy yet. What? <laughs> a crow. Witch! He spoke. It's a witch crow. Oh, it's a witch crow. The witch returns! The witch returns! This is my first time coming here, though. The witch returns! Not exactly a lizard, is he? Goose and service! <laughs> <laughs> Go to service? Witch is cracked a lot. The witch catalog? I've always wanted to try it out. You need to head towards the hay. Highlights, young lady. But can't you starve until I reach the village? After I find the village, I'm gonna make sure I'll try it out before I go to the Highland. Highland. Limited time only! Register now for gifts. <laughs> Try the witch catalog. The witch catalog. <laughs> They're handing out gifts as well, plus it's limited time only. Ah, gifts! <laughs> Multi purpose glue, kitchen accessory, a spark. In any case, I need a witch catalog. I guess it wouldn't hurt to have a pinch. To have in a pinch. You can buy ingredients or potion recipe from them. Alright, let's register for now. Thank you! Thank you for the employees. Ha! Ah! <laughs> With an employees? When? Work finish. When finished? Close for today. Close for today! God damn it. So suddenly? It's not easy to get the message across to which clothes. Mm, then I guess I should keep searching for the village. You never know when the witch's catalog will show up. Let's stick to the plan and find the village. I mean this There should be the button for inventories, right? I want 
to get a hat like that. <laughs> yeah. Gryffindor! <laughs> Talk to her. Chit chat. There are more danger in the jungle than in the desert. Why? Because you can't hide in the desert. You can't cr cross the horizon even if you run for half a day. In the jungle, you disappear before your eyes even if you take the only five steps. In the deep forest, you must be careful because plants and animals become smart as well as people. Do you need anything? Do you know when I feel the happiest while working as a paddler? I'm assuming it's when it's profitable? When you see the product properly, I feel best when I find something precious among the things laid out randomly at the country market. Then isn't it a big gain? You can buy it cheap and sell it. I can't do that. A good product must be brought, bought at a good price. But the other person didn't know. But I knew. <laughs> what if you're wrong? Then I'll have only my poor eyes to blame. Are you being too nice to, in doing business? It's been a really long time <clears throat> since I have heard that I'm nice. Don't worry. It's a matter of, of my conviction rather than how nice I am. I earned enough to get it, to get by. Do you need anything? I don't have any items ready for now. <laughs> I never bothered to run walk down here. I mean, can you just... Climb? <laughs> Alright, what's going on? Seems like it's darker. Do you sleep now? I think I had an important dream, but I can't remember it. It seems like something important. Like the principal science sermon? <laughs> That's something I don't want to think about again. Mm. Saved? Okay, it's, it's just save myself. I guess the tutorial is not done yet. Again, how the heck do I read the recipes? <laughs> oh. That freaking buttons. Yeah, there we go. God damn. Now I can make this. Potion. Rich flower and maple herb. Sure, let's do that. First. Hmm. 
Peach flower. <laughs> okay. Witch flower, maple syrup, stage four fire, and thirty right. That is the right way, right? Hold on. Clockwise. Okay. Strange has taste. And we should make one more of the potion. medicine tastes awful. <laughs> exactly. Not much of the recipe we got here, no? Where did it come from? Cough candy. Soft candy. Back scratch again. Wait, what? Where did it came from? Back scratch candy. <laughs> Why do we even need this? Oh shit. What? Anyway. Oh, we need rich flowers. Whoops. Yeah, I can keep that. I'm pretty sure there are two or th two or three more of the weed things that we have to remove. I'll do that later. Let's go to the forest first. <laughs> Bushbug. Make homes with a bush they have on sharp and characteristically large wings and such a tiny body. Should you see a moving bush, try to give it a good shake. 
Not different to the other ones, but yeah. Still, I need like the the catcher things. God damn it. <laughs> it was trying to draw <laughs> the breath fly off quickly. so much. It wasn't that big a while ago. That must be an adult honey pumpkin. We better get rid of it before it grows anymore. But I'm not even a gardener. Why? We must get rid of it to get to the new place since we haven't been behind there. Well, I guess that can be helped to get the new place. Guess I should make we Terminator potion. A witch life. It's simple because I made it once before. Don't forget to remove the nucleus if you want to avoid repeating the same thing. What's a bird like having the flowers? Coming up. Sprout bird. A common bird found in a green forest. It will sh shrivel up or bloom with the flowers. They drop their flowers behind should scare them away. If well fed, they will bloom a lot of flowers. <laughs> the burr flowers.
God damn it. Sheesh. He can't turn what he can't rate up the weed. What was the button again? Oh, there we go. <laughs> well, Virgil, there's someone stuck on the spider web. I think he lost consciousness. Is he even alive? I don't know. Hmm. Ah! <laughs> he woke up. Who? I'm Ellie, apprentice witch. A witch? Wow, this is my first time seeing a apprentice witch. This is my first time seeing someone caught on the spider web. <laughs> in his room room. I live in the village with my grandma. But now I'm stuck in the big spider web. He doesn't seem to understand the gravity of the situations. <laughs> the big spider web means there's a big spider nearby. <laughs> you be quiet. Don't worry, you'll be fine. I'll have you down. You have to be careful when dealing with the spider webs, Ellie. It looks pretty strong, one strong move, and you'll be get stuck in, in by yourself. Then what do you do? Maple herb works best against insects. Just one maple herb should be enough. There we go. If it's, it's maple herbs, I have it. Like this. Oh! <laughs> Maple herb with the spider webs, I say. Are you okay? Yeah, probably. Can you walk? Okay. Then let's go to the witch's house together. Oh. Okay. Now he follows. Oh. Freaking down the door. Hello, Ellie. Any interesting story? Ellie, do, do you like tea? Uh, sure, why not? Yeah, I like it. Well, let's drink some tea for later. I'll give it some delicious tea. Yeah, okay. <clears throat> interesting story? Ellie, what kind of tea do you like? <laughs> okay. Well, all tea stuff, huh? Sweet, aromatic tea, better tea. I don't like. <laughs> what do you mean, just like counter, counter the thing that we just said there? I like tea that has a fragrant aroma. Red flower tea is a nice romantic, aromatic one. Oh, I think I will smell good indeed. It will smell good. Shop. 
I didn't have any tea to brew yet. Oh, whatever. Wait, how did he go to come down again? Dude. <laughs> Are you okay? You hurt? I can't walk because my leg hurts. You were probably up there far too long. Now I'll give you a hug. How's that gonna help? I'll give you treatment at the witch house. Okay. Maybe. <laughs> Come on. This bird has no idea what's coming up. Damn, you fix it good. Can you acquire that? Put down the fox first. God damn it, I. Ugh. Whatever. <laughs> Put the fox down. Two. Isn't it heavy? Of course. Really? <laughs> Just stop asking. Take talking. Our village is just a little further from here, but you cannot pass through now because of the thick vines. Well, we got some fake situation going on as well. Let's go to the wish house for now and find a way. Yeah. They're here. Wow, a wish house. Thanks. What should I do? As you like. It still hurts a bit. I'll have to hurry up and get back to the village. If not, Grandma will be scout there. Will scout me. Okay, leave it to me. I'll get rid of that huge pretty line. Oh, really? I'll make sure to get you back on your village. To your village, don't worry. Okay, thanks. Oh, before that, I should treat your leg first. Rubram, wait here for a moment. So we'll be streaming tomorrow or no? Well, as the schedule I'm going here, it will gonna be like according to that. <laughs> right. Tomorrow is... Uh, what's that game? Don't Starve. Yeah. And Don't Starve next will be Vampire Survivors. And next gonna be Art Knights. You not? What? You suck. Please. I'm not sure what you're talking about. <laughs> We'd like to try this. Oh, what's this? Is it candy? Yeah, it's a candy to heal your leg. Oh, thanks. It looks delicious. Oh, it's delicious. Uh, this tastes awful. <laughs> it's good for your health. How's your leg now? Well, I think it feels better. Hey, Sally. The candy tastes awful. So, how did you get caught in the spider web? I just came to the forest to play for a little bit. But time flew by, and then the giant's pricky vines were covered the way. I was looking for the other path when I heard the sounds of train. 
maybe a bird. <laughs> oh, it must be one of the one I was riding. I went towards the train, and the strange bird suddenly started chasing after oh. out. <laughs> the bad bird chasing the fox again. It must have been that bird, not the train. It was that bird. I went to a deep place as I was running away. Then I found a treasure map and I got caught in spider web and is trying to pick it up. I would think that she will react to the treasure map. Treasure map? See? <laughs> I saw a picture of the skeleton though through the bushes. I saw in the children's book that is a sign of the pirates leaving the treasures. Shall we go check? What about the gigantic prickly vines? Oh well, we can't do much about it yet. It wouldn't hurt to try. Let's go. Ellie, can I follow you too? Wouldn't it be a lot a bit better to rest a little more? I'm bored since I'm at home all the time. What do you say? Okay, fine, but be careful. Are we? Okay, thanks. All right. We got a lot of dangled mangoes. So what do you reckon I should make more potions? I should make more of the, well, the branch remover potion or make more of the potion that heals? Kind of feels more like we're collecting stuff to get more of the, just to proceed in the quest or do things like that. Alright, now my inventory is, well, clear. Remover, yeah. Okay, Kiba. This has been like two hours for me. I will have to end this here for now. We will show you the next time at some point. I'll put it, uh, make sure I put it like in the schedule next time. Like, add some days to replace some Sunday. <laughs> if you want it. Let's see more. Right, that's it for now. Have a nice day, you guys, and see you again next time on the live stream, then. So, goodbye. Like always, you guys, like, subscribe, follow if you could for the YouTube and Twitch. I'll see you again next time. Thank you for watching once again. If you're not sure what the schedules, check the Twitch page of the schedule times. So, it's there. There are there. Thanks. So, yeah. Bye-bye. <laughs>